Home.fm is the music that makes you feel good, and I love to welcome in special guests on the show. Uh, today is someone who's very familiar with being on shows lately. As a matter of fact, she's a champion of shows. She's the 2017 America's Got Talent winner from NBC, and she's going to be coming to Jackson next week to the Jackson County Fair. I'd like to say hello to Darcy Lynn Farmer. Good morning. Good morning. Hi. Hello. And I remember the very first time I heard of you. Uh, my dad actually was a big fan of your performance, your first tryout on America's Got Talent, and sent the video to me. I hear that I'm a part of like millions <laughs> of people who were sent that video. And the video, <laughs> it just shows yeah. what a classy lady you are and what Thank a great you. talent you are as well. And tell me a little bit about what you do that makes you special. Um, ventriloquism is just such a different art, and it's the fact that I'm so picking, picking it up so young and going on the stage for all these people and just doing my thing. So tell me how you came into being a ventriloquist. I believe, didn't you get your first puppet when you were about 10 or so? Yes. So when I was younger, um, my mom put me in these little pageants, and I was really shy, and she wanted me to meet new people and, you know, be able to talk to people and perform on a big stage. And <laughs> the pageants really helped with that because they had talent day. Oh, yeah. And um, they had, like, the interview course where the judges would interview you and see if you are good at um, talking to people. And that was, like, the hardest part for me. I was like, oh, oh I yeah. Interview. Um, I met this one girl and... Um, she was 18 years old at the time. She's older now, but she was a ventriloquist. And the first time I saw her perform was we actually won our age group together. Oh, wow. And we got to travel around with three other girls because that's what you got to do if you won. And I watched her perform, and I was like, oh, my gosh. I have to do that. That is the <laughs> coolest thing I've ever seen. And... I asked her for tips and pointers, and she gave them to me, and uh, I practiced in my mirror for two weeks, and then I finally entered into my first local talent show here. I love it. Now, you have um, three puppet friends that travel along with you, um, Petunia, who's a little bit of a diva. <laughs> We've got Oscar, the little uh -huh. mouse, so a little bit shy, and then Edna. Uh, the old woman who just kind of says it like it is. Well, also, I do have a fourth puppet. Oh, you do? Um, she was my very first one. Her name's Katie. Katie. Uh, everyone thinks that Petunia like, is my very first puppet, but she's actually not. Oh, okay. Um, Katie, if you look her up, she's a cowgirl. <laughs> she used, my very first puppet was an eBay puppet, and she had blonde yarn hair, but her head was hard to move, and... She wasn't really good at moving. <laughs> her mouth was really big. And so we asked a really respected puppet maker named Mary Ann, and she made me a new Katie Aww. and that has uh, red hair, and uh, she's easy to move. She's a, like a real puppet now. Oh. So she kind of got a makeover, but um, Katie's my very first puppet, and she travels with us too. So um, you have been doing some crazy things because of America's Got Talent kind of tossed you into this whole new world. Now, your friends are, you know, spending time on their cell phones and hanging out and laughing and at the mall, and you're traveling all around. You just went to Hawaii. Was that a special <laughs> time with your family? Yes, that was so fun. We went everywhere. I don't think there was a spot on that island that we didn't go. <laughs> cool. Um, we had a lot of fun it was really fun and it looks like you even got to go scuba diving too how cool yeah well it was actually i we, we didn't go scuba diving we actually went snuba with an n oh okay yeah it's it's weird it's kind of if you do breathe from, from a tank but it's on the tank float on a raft above you oh. and then you connect with a tube and then it just follows you around Oh, that's kind of cool. You can stay underwater, but you don't have to be certified, and you don't have to carry the two, the t tank down with you. Yeah, because those are really heavy, aren't they? I'm not Ridiculous. sure. Yeah. But I bet 
crazy heavy. They are. <laughs> <laughs> cool. Well, we are looking forward to you coming to the Jackson County Fair. Uh, like I said, that's next week, Monday, August 6th. It looks like you're going to be joined by a group called Pelican, is it 212? Is that a group that you travel with that yeah, you know Pelican about? Yeah, Pelican 212. Okay. They are a family band, and I first met them on Little Big Shots. This is my very first oh, yeah. TV performance I've ever done um, with Steve Harvey. I met them there. We became good friends. And then I saw them again at AGT. They were also on AGT. I don't know if you saw them. but oh, okay. I didn't even know they were coming, and I saw them, and I was like, oh, my gosh. <laughs> After I won, I was, like, wanting to go on tour, mm-hmm. and um, I needed I needed an opening act. And so my dad was like, why not Pelican 2 and 2? And I was like, hey, that's a really good idea. So we called them up, and I was like, hey, I'm going on tour. You guys want to come? <laughs> and they were like, oh, absolutely, yes. It's really fun. They're an awesome group of people. And um, they're very, very talented, so it's been fun with them. Well, great. Now, you get a lot of credit for being a ventriloquist, but I hear that you're quite the uh, singer as well. Will you be doing singing and ventriloquism as a part of what you do? I will be singing with my mouth open. (laughs) And um, I've sang since I was six. My mom taught me because my mom's a singer. Very perfect. Now, once again, we're going to be welcoming you to the Jackson County Fair um, Monday, August 6th. Your show is at 6 p.m. As we just talked about, uh, you'll have your guests, uh, Pelican 2 and 2, on tour with you as well. And if people mm-hmm. come to the show, what can they expect for the evening? They are definitely going to expect lots of singing and dancing and um, all different kinds of music they get to enjoy. They'll laugh a lot until their stomach hurt. And it's Definitely a family-friendly show for the fam. Well, awesome. Thank you so much, Darcy Lynn. We are looking forward to seeing you, and I have had so much fun. I told you earlier before we were on the air that I am just so giddy. I feel like I'm at a birthday party with you, and we're just having a little chat overnight and just having a great time. So thank you so much, <laughs> and we're, we're so looking forward to it. We'll see you very soon. Thank you. All righty. Have a great week. Bye. <laughs> Bye.